Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. If you're new to my channel, hi, I'm Akanksha. So what's up you guys? It feels like I'm filming after ages. I know I say that in every video, but it really is. So uh, yeah, this is the new background. This is going to be the background for like two, three months more. Uh, you guys know, or if you guys don't know that I shifted uh, to a new house for like a couple of months because I had to get my other house renovated like my whole family moved here so this is going to be the new background for like two three months now and then we'll go back to our new room which is getting renovated anyway so today we are going to play with makeup I guess that's like the worst intro ever of course like we're going to make play with makeup so today uh we are going to play with this palette this is uh the pewder pewder i cannot pronounce it this is a gorgeous eyeshadow palette they sent this over to me so i thought i'll do a look with it so such a pretty palette they have some uh lipsticks as well so let's get into the video and uh, do a look So I've been wanting to do this look since so long. Uh, I'll just post a picture here. It's that very nice, I don't know how to describe it. I don't know if it has a name. If it has a name, then I'll put it here. I love how that looks. So I want to take it further. I wanted to recreate that. Uh, I thought I'll do it on IG, but then I, I saw this palette and I was like, let me do this on YouTube as well. Because this has one shade which I am so obsessed about. <laughs> like i mean look at that shade like if you just pat it in it's so beautiful it's very like holographic and all so i'm going to put that in the like you know between the lid and then do some look which i think stop it get some help first i have that eyebrow pencil as well i love the packaging dude like it's so nice and cute so this is the eyebrow art long lasting uh, makeup in the shade too so this is how the pencil looks so it has the name on it just it's eyebrow art so i'm just going to fill my brow you guys know i don't do much to my brows it's a very thin pointed down brush So what's up? What are 2020 plans? How's 2020 treating you guys? Today is Valentine's Day by the way. I'm filming this. I don't know when I'm going to post this. Uh, so yeah, let's start off. See that, that's how the brow looks. I actually like the pencil. It's really decent. The pigmentation is really good. Um, so this is how the brow looks. I'm just going to carve that brow out and I'll be back. So I use the Maybelline Instant Age Rewind on my eyes. I always use that for many eyeshadow looks. So I know it's going to be good anyway. Uh, I cannot find my... Where did you go, honey? Three hours later. Can you move it along? Oh, I don't think I've ever done a chit chat get it red, get it red, get red, get ready with me. Uh, let me know if you guys would be interested. Today's video is sort of like that, but not really. So uh, I am going to use the, this palette and uh, let me start off with packing this color. So a lot has been happening and uh, no, sorry, actually I want to pack this color. I want to like this so yeah let me discuss what's happening um so uh until now in 2020 what i did was i did my lookbook which turned out super super amazing the two girls i worked with are like super sweet one's a blogger and one's a model and both of them were really sweet to help me out in the whole thing i asked them to come like you know for the shoot and then they really agreed and they came and they made uh, everything worked out so well. They were super, super sweet. And after that, um, yeah, I did my first bride, guys. Like, I did my first bride. Um, I She loved the makeup. It made me really, really happy. So, yeah, that was a really good start for 2020. And then other than that, um, oh, your girl was a meme as well. That, I don't know, some person posted something about, um, like, makeup or something like my extreme i usually try to make an like images like that just because you know it's extreme and people will watch so somebody took a screenshot and um, 
just made a meme and you guys are so sweet that um, you know you texted me like you know it's okay don't feel bad and all i i really didn't care a lot because uh, people talk dude like you know i am into makeup so much so i've had people tell me like why do you wear so much or uh, things of that sort but that really doesn't bother me because i know everybody is going to have a different opinion and uh, my opinion according to me i am doing what makes me happy so according to that person if that's not okay it's fine it just bothers me sometimes when they try to opinionate me about like they enforce their opinion on me so i know a lot of people like people dm me and all ki you know we love to make makeup but you know guys i don't know what their problem is i'm like if you don't want to trust a girl over makeup then that just shows how small of a heart you have so that's just the truth you know if you are such a hypocrite and yeah so anyway i know everybody has their own likes and wishes but just because uh, people text me like you know oh i want to wear this but you know my boyfriend is going to say la 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 and i'm like just wear it do like it's your face at the end of the day it's you you needs to be happy if you want to try something out if you want to do it then just do it you know i know i ended up giving a lot of bashing but anyways yeah at the end of the day if you like wearing makeup do if you don't like then well and good but just don't not wear it because somebody's commenting on it or anything like if someone is making fun of you for doing what you love then you can never ever be happy and do what you love because you're listening to what the definition of you know what they want you to be and what's not cool what's cool so never do that and uh, just shut up like you know when they do make them shut up or if you just stop caring so yeah that's your kamsha mata of the day no god please no no what are you please collect your award ladies and gentlemen kamsha just blending that shade into the crease i did not take any additional color i am just blending the same color which is already on the lid i really don't like to get the color here right here because i want it to be really bright no matter which color is it i just don't like bringing that color till there because i want that area to always be brightened up because for my face that's how it looks good I know I look crazy but it's going to come together don't you worry my child so next I'm just going to take this color this is the shade uh, flipped rose 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 the first shade was brick splash by the way so I'm just going to take that shade and blend the edges even more <laughs> just makes me so happy i i don't think anybody understands that uh but yeah, a person who loves and genuinely you know feels it's like that meditation phase so i don't know it just that it just feels so satisfying and complete when i start a look and then it gets like it turns out how i want it to be or just the colors make me so happy so and now i'm just i'm just going to take that brick splash again a little just because it lost a little intensity the colors are blending quite well i don't want to get the shade in center because i just want that center to be like really popping if that makes any sense ow my leg what my thing is i sit down and film i sit on the floor so i sit like this and i film so my legs like my feet get cramped so easily or oh, it's annoying half of my time goes in just getting rid of it i'm super excited to get a nice room a table a place lighting everything to just sit and film so that's the upper lid i'm just going to take the tiniest 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 bit of concealer to clean that away i'm not going to take excess i'm just going to take whatever is left on the back of my uh, hand matlab i'm just telling you the example so just take very very less and i'm just going to apply like 
that much like it's there but not there just to clean up enough you know and create that space a really clean space not a cut crease not everything not like anything of that sort just that really really small uh light tap of concealer so that whatever we pack now would just stay in place really really well so first i i want to gl uh, gl go in with crystal flake first which i swatched on my hand earlier with you but uh first i want to lay down a color for it to just stay well so i'm just going to take this color this is salmon and i'm just going to pack that color on the lid first and then go in with the crystal flake so beautiful so nice i'm just going to spritz my uh brush a little because it's not coming out so well much better and anyways i'm just lightly packing it because i don't want like the overload of the color just a tiny bit next i there's amethyst here this shade i'm going to go in with this shade now that's so pretty so i'm just going to take my finger take that shade this is how that looks focus so i'm just going to pack that So nice. I'm just going to take a brick splash a little more and blend on the outer because I think it's a little dull here. I'm going to lift it up a little to give that definition. So that's how it looks up till now. So so pretty, you guys. So I'm just going to take the same uh, shade, brick splash. And go on my lower lash line. It's very weird because um, the brick splash looks really, really you know this burnt red brown kind of shade. And then when I mix uh, that with the flipped rose, it gave me such a very mauvey like that pink toned look more than the warm toned. So that's really beautiful. So I'm just gonna take that and apply. So and they even sent me two eyeliners. These are the two shades. One is Stormer and one is um, Asphyxia. So I'm just going to use Stormer and line my lids. I'm not going to do like a very dramatic liner or anything. Just a regular normal liner because I want the eyes to have its moment. So I'm just going to take the liner. This is how the tip looks. I'm just going to quickly pop on some lashes and I'll be back. So yeah, I'm back. I'm like, I popped on some lashes. I popped on the Bronson M75 lashes. Uh, it's really funny because um, they have all the names regarding it because it's pack. So I don't know. So uh, yeah, this is the look. And do they did send me a lipstick as well. Uh, I'm just going to swatch that lipstick for you. This is super cute. This is like in the form of a cigarette. So this is the color this is such a rich color i'm so terrible at swatching like it's not even funny at this point so that is the shade of the lipstick this is in the shade 15. i actually sh uh, chose the that brick red brick brown type of thing on my lips because i wanted it to go with the lipstick but then that town turned out to be a little pinky every, anyway uh so this is the look uh this is how it looks i love the eye makeup i wanted to do this look since so long it looks so damn pretty dude like when the light hits that center bar <gasps> so so pretty maybe i'll do one more with some other color this looks so so pretty so warm and this is the lipstick um 
I don't know. I feel this video was just all over the place. It was just me talking and getting ready and using those products. So yeah, that's it for today's video. All the products will be linked in the description bar. And if you like the video and if you enjoyed the video, make sure hit the like button and subscribe to my channel and ring the notification bell so that you get notified every time I post. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye. I don't think I've ever done a chit chat. Get it right. Get right. Even if you did, make sure hit the thumbs button and uh, uh, thumbs button, like button. Uh, thumbs button, right? Yeah.